Hey family and welcome back to my channel. If you want to see how I updated my door with a privacy screen, stay tuned. Okay guys, so what I am doing right now is I am going to remove the mask tape that I put on the glass when I was going to paint it. So it's pretty, pretty easy to remove and all you need is, um, can you see, I see that? Okay, so I think, oh my gosh, I'm trying to, okay, I guess you guys can see it. So it's like a razor. Okay, so basically what you're going to do is just score um, the edges and then peel it up. Okay, so you just go right into the edge, you score down, and as you can see, like, there is a little bit of paint on it, so guys, I like in the background, like she was not talking until I put my camera on. So you do like that, and then you can take it from any end. You just want to get like for it to pick up at some point, or if you need it to start, right? want a start and once you got a start so all the paint that had gotten on this is gonna come off on it as well okay so that's how you take it off and then you can just go in with the razor and get the little bit that didn't come off it's never a lot. It's just probably when you were scoring, you didn't score that part good. Or maybe you didn't have any there, so that's why I'm seeing paint. But there it is. It's off. Okay? So I'm going to do, I already did these three down here. I have the three to the bottom. Well, I have two to the bottom. I did four down here. Um... I am going to, I'm going to finish taking, leave it Zyla. I'm gonna finish taking these off, taking them off, and then I'll come back to show you the film that I am going to add to it because I do not want to put, a, a, um, I don't want to put back a drapery up here. And uh, with this glass, of course, you can see the road is out there so people see directly into my house. So I'm going to add a film to this. Okay, so let me finish taking these off. And then um, I'll show you guys me putting the film on. 2022, the year of the outstanding. Hi guys, and welcome back. For those of you who have seen me for the first time on this channel, we do interior design, we do vlogging, and we do some DIYs. So if that is what you're looking for, go ahead, hit that subscribe button. Now guys, let's get into this video.
Okay, so this is the um, film, and I have two. So I got this style. Um, it's hard for you to see it in the paper, so I'll pop a picture of it on the screen. And I also got this one. I forgot what this one looks like. I know I was gonna put one on this door and one on the back door. Um, Oh, I remember this one. Damn, I don't remember which one I want to use though. I forgot. I think this one I was going to put on this door. Because. Is it? I thought this thing said it came with the, the thing to put it on with. These doggone people. Yeah, I think this one I was, I was gonna put on this door. I'm gonna go back on to see how it looks so I can remember. Okay, so this is the one that I'm putting in front here. This is the one that I'm putting in front here. So basically, you put it on with water. So basically, um, you just measure here, here, but you leave a little excess. And once you get it on, then you'll cut it. So I'll show you guys how I'm doing that, okay? I already measured it. Let me measure and cut it, and then get back to you guys. Okay, so there's a rough side, and there's a smooth side. The smooth side has a film on it that you need to take off. So once I get that film off, and I, I'll spray the glass, and then show you how to put it on. So I'm gonna take this, to try and find the end. Okay, so see it's two pieces. So this smooth side is the side that will go on the glass. So you have to get some um, soapy water in a bottle and you want to spray it on the glass a lot of it Zyla excuse grandma please so you need like a lot of water move Okay guys, so what I'm doing here is I'm improvising. Uh, I do not have the actual tool. It's like a flat um, plastic that you, it looks similar to what I have, it just don't have the handle like that. And that's what you would use to kind of um, remove the bubbles, remove the water. So basically you're um, pressing it on the, the film and you're pushing outwards to try to get the water bubbles out um, of it and then um, what I'm doing here is I am using that as a straight edge and then I'm scoring it with the razor to remove the excess screen, um, film that I don't need. And then now I'm going through with a napkin and I'm wiping the water away. So like I said before, there is no adhesive involved in this. It's just water and static is what um, makes it adhere to the glass. And if you ever want to remove it, you can just find one of the ends and pull it off and you wouldn't have any adhesive or anything residue like that on your glass. You just wipe your glass off and go. That's what I like about this. The mistake that people make when they're applying this is that they do not use enough water. You have to use a lot of water to do it. If you just spray a little bit of water and try to put it on, it's not going to adhere. You have to spray a lot of water. And of course, the water has to be soapy water. So just add some Dawn, Dawn or whatever soap liquid that you have 
add it in the spray bottle and use that spray it on the glass it's gonna adhere okay but you have to use a lot of water now what I'm doing now is I'm wiping out the water um, I'm being extra someone else probably would have already moved on but I'm being extra <laughs> Okay, so again, this is pretty easy to install. Um, it did upgrade the look of the door, and I like the privacy that it did. So I'm still allow, I'm still like getting um, that natural light coming into the space, but I have my privacy. The only thing, the only drawback is I used to like to look up and be able to see my like packages out there. That yes, I have packages. <laughs> But now I can't. Okay. So basically that's how it looks. And it can easily come off because there's no adhesive, no glue or anything. It's just the water and static that's holding it to the wall, to the window. So um, if you ever want to just change it out, you don't like it, it's easy to just grab it and peel it off. Okay, there's no glue. So I am going to do the rest of this. Um, and then I'll show you how it looks when I'm finished. Okay guys, as you can see, it's finished. So I'm not installing up on top here because I only need privacy to right there. And to be honest with you, that would be very cumbersome to try to cut that. So I'm not even going there. Maybe on another day when I have the, um, the strength to be bothered with it mentally right now no but I don't think up there need it I just need the film down here was it hard to install no it was not um, all you gotta do is cut it put the water the hardest thing was trying to get the plastic off of the back um, trying to find the, the in between you just gotta keep trying it with the razor and it'll come off so that's how it looks it looks great okay so I also changed the light switch right here I changed it to a black one I'm gonna go in with the paint and I'm gonna paint around here blue to um, help it to disappear more okay so what I've been doing guys is I've been updating the light switches in my house to this this one versus these I have to do that one next so I've been updating them and um, piece by piece and that's what you have to do like just take your time and do what you have to do so I am going to Home Depot in a second because it's about to snow and I need something to do while it's snowing. And I am going to, um, I'm gonna paint here. Oh, I need to get wood for the fireplace to turn it on. So I'm gonna get some, um, I'm gonna paint here. I need to get the molding to put down here so I can paint that. So in front here will be completely finished. I'm gonna paint the wall and stuff. And the major thing that I'm going to do is I am going to finish up here my fireplace. I still have to finish that trimming going around and I have to put that tile in. Okay, I turned that off. So, I'm going to get the trim to put around here so that this can finally be finished. It was like this for years. And now that I've done this and it's like, so you're not going to finish that? So the top piece of tile I have to cut and put there and over there. I'm going to do all of that, do all my trim work, get that finished paint I have some um, caulking to redo so like some of the caulking up there like in the corners you see it wait you can probably see it more in this one so now that like everything is starting to like settle or whatever the caulking is now I can go in and do my final caulking again um, like up here, you see that up there? So I need to put caulking up there so that everything will be nice and smooth and you gotta let stuff dry, let it settle. 
Um, then right here, you see right there? So now that that is basically settled, I can go in and recock it, okay? So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go to Home Depot, I'm gonna get my trims so that I can put my trims in and um, finish this off, okay? She said she running away